And Louis here now. Good morning. Good well, morning. Good just morning. Good afternoon. morning. Uh, you looked incredibly relieved to be, out to be out when it finished. You have no idea. <laughs> Back in the real world. Yes. It was nothing like I thought it was going to be. It was a lot tougher and I could cope with the days, but I couldn't cope with the nights. Well, I read about that. That's of, true. Of you waking up in the night and almost having panic attacks in a room full I of was. people. A dark room. Yeah. And I, it was locked. I couldn't get out. You know, and that drove me crazy for a while. And you were in a room with a lot of other people that, yeah. that previously, the first three weeks, you hadn't known. It was 12 before. people. And I was waiting for them to wake up. I was waiting for somebody to wake up every morning <gasps> for contact. Uh, lots of people getting in touch with us, Lou, oh. with all sorts of questions. Oh, God. Uh, firstly, lots <laughs> of them want to know, what made you want to do the show in the first place? Daisy Lou said that. I was asked a few times before, will right. I do the show? Okay. And I always said no. And I said no at the start. And then somebody said, if you don't do this, you're going to be sorry. And I thought, life's too short, I'll do it. I didn't know it was going to be as tough. I really didn't know. What was it like when Sharon was in the house? That she, must have been a great... Cos she's like your ally. She's, she's a, great fun. Yeah, you know Mrs she's o. brilliant. And she's fun and she's not afraid to say what she thinks. But she was in a different bedroom. You know, she had her own little dark room. Um, and then she went after ten days and I was yes. fine. Right. I was fine. The days I coped with, it was the night time. Was so, and, and when you say it was the night time that you, uh, that you struggled with, was it just you weren't sleeping particularly I well? I wasn't sleeping at all. So then during the day, then you're going to be shattered? Exactly. You got it. Yeah. I was absolutely sure. And there was a lot of people in there. They were all performing. And I was watching them all performing for the camera. They were all cleaning and cooking food and performing for the camera. Well, that was... I didn't want to do that. Well, yeah, and you didn't. I and didn't. They, and they, they said you were lazy, lazy because Louis. you didn't do it. Would you lazy. agree or...? I don't cook food much. You know, I wasn't <laughs> going to you. clean up. I was going to sit back and I was watching. Yeah, but I do the cleaning. Yeah, yeah, I do, yeah, 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 yeah you do. It's not that I'm lazy. I was watching them all performing. It was incredible. Mm. They all wanted to win. Uh, Nin says, who was your least favourite housemate, Louis? Oh, probably the guy that went out first. Oh, Gary. Gary, I think Gary. Why? Went I didn't get to know. OK. And I didn't see the real person. And we tried to talk to him a bit. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing, nothing going on. Favourite housemate? Who was your favourite? Oh, I liked a lot of them. I have their names here. I liked Marisha a lot. She didn't get the credit she, she deserved because she's a great, great singer. And she can, she's like Beth Midler. Really? You know? Oh, yeah. Wow. She's yeah. amazing. You've worked in the entertainment industry for a very, very long time. Uh, and there were times when I was thinking, you're chatting about people that you've worked with in a very open way. Did you forget that you were being filmed? Was there sort of... A little bit. I wasn't being malicious about it. I was just kind of telling me what they're really like. You know, I wasn't being malicious. Nobody's perfect, you know? Yeah. And I have worked with people that I've said things about that I kind of regret. Right. I do regret that. Special national. But that's me. Is that, is that previous to this or is that during Big Brother? generally. Ge generally. It's generally, yeah. Did you have a game plan before you went no. in? Were you, no. Or, or had you in your own mind gone, actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to talk about this, but I'm not going to talk about that, or I'm going to reveal a bit of this, or let's make mm. it really entertainment. Let's, let's... Uh, I was only going to be honest, as much as I could be. Yeah. You know, because I didn't want to fake it. Mm. I didn't want to do like everybody else was. So I sat back and watched everything, and I was telling Big Brother what was going on. He was really tough. It was, really? It's really, it's a lot more tough to be in there than you think. Can you explain, leaving the sleeping aside, can you explain what you mean by tough? Is it having those rules and regulations to follow? Is it being surrounded by people who are performing? What was tough, Louis? Everything. You're in a room with 12 people for three weeks that you don't know. And they're all acting, they're all performing, they're all saying different things. And you're standing there and saying, why? That wasn't a surprise, though, Louis. Had you watched Big Brother before? I mean... I'd, I'd kept my eye on it. But I wasn't like... I didn't know the ins and outs of it. Okay. But it's a great show. We were really well looked after. The medical team were incredible. Right. Well, incredible. They were behind the scenes and they watched us. Uh, they, it, you have, are always and have always been exceptionally honest. Uh, it was a great show and we have loved watching it. Okay. Uh, it's what makes you who you, who you are. I think it's an Irish thing. Do you think it's, do you think I it's think an Irish it's an thing? I think it's an Irish thing. You'd know. Probably. I, yeah, you know. <laughs> we, we tend to say what we feel. Well, we've got a little VT of some of the things that you said while you were in there. Oh, no. we, you can try and explain these for us as I well. i try. <laughs> <laughs> now, to, well, there's lots in there to oh, unpack. I kind of regret... Listen, Ron and I is a little bit of panto. Yeah, you know? OK. Yes. I loved working with him. He was a great worker. Yeah. He's very driven. He He's is. very good. Very talented. Yeah, and he sacked me, so... You know, I don't say great things about him, but I don't resent him. And he's, good, he's a good person. 
Yeah. So I have to put that out there. Yeah. And it's a bit of panto between the two of us. OK. There's a few other bits and pieces in there as well that you were talking about. I mean, when you look at that back there, Louis, do you think maybe I sh you should have been a bit yeah. more cautious? Yeah, I should have been, but I'm not. And that's what makes the show, you just be honest. Yeah. People being honest. You've you got to tell it like it is. Yeah. Has Simon been in touch with you? No. Has he not? No, because it's not his show. No, I know, but he but would I have love heard you. Simon, I love working with him. Well, you've worked together closely for many, many years, oh. but, you, but you're also saying the fix was in. Simon wanted Cheryl to win, so he got a Beyonce. Well, he liked, he liked Cheryl, yeah. And by getting a Beyonce, it, it, it was, it was going to win. But I like Cheryl too. Yeah. You know, everybody has a good side. I loved working with Carl. I loved working with him, as you did. Yeah. And what about the Colin Farrell of it all? That's a true story. <laughs> Is it really? That would happen in the party in Dublin, yeah. Yeah, because he was always hanging around. He used to teach line dancing. He's a very decent guy, and he's, he's earned his craft. But not yeah. a singer, you were saying. No, he's not a singer, but he tried it out. He was fun. He's not a bad actor, though, Louis, and you oh, told him he was amazing. wasting his time. <laughs> I did. <laughs> I was wrong. <laughs> I'm not always right. Now, we can't ask you about everything, which we would love to, but we're going to respect that. But I do want to ask you and Sharon, would you do more stuff with Sharon? Because what we loved that was seeing the two of you back together. If it was fun. Life is too short. I want to have fun now. I love Sharon. She's an energy. She's, she's, she's a force. Yes. She brings something new to everything. Yes. I love working with her. A little bit of goggle box with the two of them watching oh, telly and that... commenting on the telly. Maybe. That I, could be. I don't know. I honestly don't know. It's up to her. I know she's moving back here. Yeah. She is, yeah. She's smart, she's sparky, she's smart, she says yeah. what she thinks, she's and the a, two of you together have the best... Afraid. Yeah, you have Can't, the best chemistry. She's not afraid to say anything. To We've anybody. had someone's just said, yeah. now you've done this, will you be doing I'm a Celebrity? No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you not very much. No. no. Not strictly, not none of those.